What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to It's Super Dark and Nobody Can See Farm. Welcome to everybody. We have, well, some stuff that we need to sell right here, right now. The price is great. $680. I've looked, that's as high as it's going to go today, which means we need to sell ASAP as quick as possible. We're going down to the grain mill. I'm not going to make you sit through that because it's dark and nobody can see nothing. So where are we going? Grain mill. Where is that? Oh, it's right there. We've been down there before. Let's see if we can make it without crashing. Yeah, we're probably going to crash. I will say that it is ever so slightly difficult to get in and out and get ourselves moving around in here just for the simple fact that there is snow everywhere. Yo, I have tripped on this snow and I have went sliding at least three times getting over here. But we're here and I'm probably driving like a maniac. So there might be that. Oh, I can't stop. We're good. I can't. I can't stop. <laughs> snow all over the place man all right i know it is dark i know we can't see nothing but it is time to sell and it is time to make money hopefully we do well let's see what we're gonna do so we're at least we're in the green right now that is good okay there's four thousand five thousand eleven thousand dollars off of the full harvest not happy about that not at all there's no money to be made there but we can at least come in here and we can repay the loan. There we go. Repay as much as it would let us. There we go. Some some just happened there. I, I believe something just happened there. Regardless, what do we have? 50? I thought we had like $10,000. Oh, we're going to crash. Let's go get the rest of it. And here is our second load right here. I did go back and check and see. We had the amount of money we should have had. Pull it right here. Get the tip. Watch it tipping. See if we can back up. There's no way to get light around here. Okay, so after it's all said and done, we were able to pay back. After this is said and done, repay. We were able to pay back about ten thousand dollars of our loan. Plus, we were able to get a little bit of. No, we didn't make any money. Let's let's not kid ourselves here. Yeah, we walked away with that pretty darn poor. Let's be honest here. We didn't make a whole lot of money off of that at all. Uh, let's see, we made seventeen thousand three hundred forty-seven dollars. However, we were in debt what six or seven grand by the time right before we started. So, yeah, that's that. Yeehaw! So let's uh, let's keep rocking. Let's wait until the day hits, or at least something. We may have to. Well, a we can pass this truck right here, and then B. I think we may have to just go into hibernation for a while ourselves and just see what happens. Get some of this snow out of here. There we go, a little bit of light. And we're making money as well. Keep in mind, we've still got that solar panel and it seems to be doing pretty well for us right now. We're making good money back, which is great. It's doing well. So we've already made, it's not even noon yet. We're at 60, there we go, noon, $6,100. I gotta go in here, I'm gonna repay this. The more that we can repay and the faster that we can repay that loan, the less money we will owe from day to day when it comes to interest. That is the biggest point and the biggest part about having a loan is the money to pay the interest. Sometimes it doesn't matter. Today, it matters a whole lot. So we're in midwinter right now. I don't even think there's any, uh, let's see, fertilizing, fertilizing. I'm not, no. And bailing, seriously? We're in midwinter, you want me to bail? Bruh. No, I'm not doing that. I'm pretty sure those, uh, pretty sure they're glitched a little bit. Nonetheless, we're gonna keep rocking. We're gonna keep rolling. I'm going to man this thing. <laughs> Turn some lights on so we can see what's going on. I'm gonna keep watching our money and I'm gonna keep paying off more and more and more. See, we just hit it again. So I'm gonna come back in here, repay. Boom, right there. Now, we're at $430,000 loan. Today alone, I believe we pay back, what, $20,000? I, I believe. Yeah, twenty it says we made $27,000. So that would make sense. Let's hop right here. See if we can get close. And just kind of fast forward that. 12 hours as fast as we possibly can. So after it was all said and done, it says we made $13,200. But again, just like every day, here we are. Late winter. Is there anything we can do here? Nope, nothing that we can do here. And it's still stuck on all this. I'm pretty sure that that is not right. Not right at all. 
Regardless. Oh, me. Let's see if we can get rid of this snow. Well, unfortunately for us, uh, it's early spring. The snow is still here. It is going down. However, the snow is still here, and the ground is still completely frozen. Hey, it went down another one. You can see where everywhere I've driven. But again, there is nothing that we can do today. So, onward forth we go to mid-spring. Onward forth we march. Now, we are all set, ready to go. The snow is gone. And we've got one more fertilization state to toss on everybody. And then we are going to be good to go, at least for our main crops. Now, the grass, of course, the grass, unfortunately, is going to take another fertilization on top of this. But the good thing is, we can do that right before it's ready to cut. So that's going to be great. And I'm not going to make you, uh, I'm not going to bore you with this, but I'm just going to go through and spray. Also, don't forget, we still need to put lime down in the three fields that we made over the sheep pen and the two cow pastures. That's going to be something that we've got to figure out as well because we don't have a fertilizer spreader. So what we may have to do is try to get one, <laughs> as it were. We'll try and get one and then maybe use that and lime this. Eh. Hey, it's worth a shot, right? Well, we've got a really good opportunity. We've already finished all that. And there's an opportunity that I think has uh, well, brought itself to the, the front, forefront. And I want to take a look at it and see if we can make it happen. So I'm still under the influence that the contracts are bugged, right? But field 16, $6,200 to fertilize that field. I'm going to accept the contract. Yeah, definitely going to accept that contract. That's a whole lot. I don't know if we're going to be able to get it done with what we have. We may end up having to come back and fill this guy up again. Also, I feel like we take a lot of fertilizing contracts and we're just constantly fertilizing anyway. But you know what? It makes money. It really does. It's doing us well, too. I'm happy about it. Kind of, you know, it is what it is nonetheless. All right, rolling up on it, field 16 on the front left. And it seems like there's, what is that, canola, I believe? I believe that is canola. Let's go ahead and see if we can get down in here. We might be able to knock this field out pretty darn fast, especially for what they're paying us. That's going to be a whole payment by itself, which is great. I'm real happy about that. Why are we at negative $2? That's, that seems unfair. <laughs> Come on, man. Negative two dollars. Haven't you taken my money enough, man? All right. Let's put it right here. Let's go ahead and select sprayer. Let's bring that down. Doesn't need to be too high. Get in a position where we could see everything and go. Now, hopefully again, like I said, this contract has been here since the fall. And so I'm really hoping that we're going to be able to do just fine with this and there's nothing glitched as far as the money goes. Another thing that I am concerned about, like I'd said before, is the fact that we may not be able to finish this contract because we don't have enough fertilizer. I don't want to have to take out another loan just to pay for the fertilizer. We will if we have to. Tell you what, this series right here, this one in particular, is causing me a whole lot of heartache. And it is so difficult, but it is really cool to be able to say, okay, you know, throw in some, some logical problem solving and uh, that kind of thing. Because I am so used to just cheating my way through if I need to. And there is no cheating when it comes to this. There is no way to cheat. I mean, well, of course there's a way to cheat, but we're not. We're going everything, you know, it's funny I say that as we're going here, 24 miles per hour spraying, but nonetheless, we're using just as much uh, fertilizer as we would, depending on how fast we'd be going. So that, I'm not really sure that's cheating in the first place. We're using just as much. We're just getting it done faster. That's the only thing there. There's that. So we have used well over a thousand liters on the headland. Hopefully we can get this thing done without any problems whatsoever. Oh, come on, six grand, I need you. 1,000 liters left. Oh, man, can we do it? Can we get this field done? I don't think that we can. There's 800 right there. I think we're... Yeah, this is not going to end well, is it? 
Nope, not at all. Come on, go, 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 go. All I need for it to do is say, Contract on field, blah, blah. Finished. But it's not gonna do that, is it? And we're almost at 500 liters now. Oh, we're doing good though. How much, uh, what's our thing? 91% done. Oh man, come on, DJ. Get it together, baby. Get it together. You could do this. You could do this. There's 400 liters right there. Oh, 320. I'm going to leave that sliver because. Oh, don't crash. I'm going to leave that sliver right there because I can't get my entire width on there and I'm still using. Oh, man. Where is it right here? Oh, my goodness. Contract on field. Blah, blah is finished. Yes. Completed. Collect. That's my money. Gimme. What else can we do? Bailing on field 27. Are you kidding me? Where's field 27 at? Oh, please don't be a big field. Please don't be a big field. Please don't be a big field. Where's field to Oh, it's right there, isn't it? Let's see. You know, it's straight on. It's not that bad. Uh, yeah, uh, you know what? I'm going to wait another day because we are going to take that. Uh, we're going to take the equipment from that. We're going to use that equipment on our own fields. So we have gone another two days. It is now early summer. Can you believe it? we've almost gone a whole year at this point? Goodness gracious. We need to get some... <laughs> we need fertilizer. We're down to 405... Oh, me, oh, my. We're down to $405,000 loan. Not too shabby. However, we're out of fertilizer. Borrow... Five grand, goodness, we're already we're already under five grand. How did that happen? And uh, I think we're just gonna you know, fill this guy up more or less. Just let it go. I don't care. We're gonna need it all eventually anyway. So what's the point? There we go. So we just bought four thousand nine hundred and ninety-six dollars worth of liquid fertilizer. Now we should be able to get in because the grass has fully grown. Now it is early summer. So we should be able to get in all the fields, get the grass fertilized one more time before we do the cut. And we're going to have to go in. I think we're going to have to borrow a little bit more money as well because we've got to get the equipment needed for the job. Now, the job at hand is going to be baling, mowing and baling. Now, I don't know exactly what we're going to do with it. We are uh, we've obviously need to do like a grass or, well, I say grass. We could technically just get it and pick it up. The problem is we'd have to lease all the equipment to make it happen. All right, let's rock through here. This won't take long. It's not going to take a whole lot of, uh, well, it's not going to take a whole lot of nothing, really. I just need to be able to get this done. Spin it. There we go. Hit our headlands, and this is good. Remember, we've got three grass fields total. I don't think we're going to get a whole lot out of them. But it's going to be enough, hopefully. Enough. If it pays for the seeds the first time around, I'll be happy. Somebody was saying at one point in time, said, DJ, you know, just, just do the grass fields and then take whatever money you make from that, add it to what you got, or use the grass, do it hay, and then give that to your cows. So if we can get a bailing contract where we can get... Ooh, <laughs> it's like a cinematic flyover view right there. If we can get a contract that gives us uh, hay bales or that we have to do hay bales what we could do is we can make those hay bales and then just bring them over and hang on to them at least so if we do get some cows because we can get free water so if we get some cows what we'll do is we'll be able to give them hay at least for a little while maybe we got one cow two cows something like that uh people were telling me that cows make quite a bit of money on this map so that is good as well another thing i'm considering in order to make money, make money quick, this make money quick scheme is what it is, is to get another solar panel and put that up. I know we've gone almost a year and it still hasn't paid for itself, but, uh, you know, if we got two, two gives us twice as much money. So technically we'll be able to pay back our loan twice as fast. Eh? eh you see what I'm, you see what I'm, see, see, can you smell what I'm stepping in? That's what I'm saying right there. Oh, keep crashing. So that is another option, and to be honest with you, it is an option that I am highly considering because we'll be able to pay back our loan twice as fast as we would with just one. Again, I'm really, really considering that. Let me know if that's something that you would do as well.
So here's the game plan. Here's exactly what we are going to do. We are going to jump in and we're going to take Field 27 contract. Let's see where it is. Right there. So this is going to make us $10,000 because we can make everything. However, the problem is we've got to make silage bales. So we're going to take all that. I'm going to accept the contract and borrow the items at the same time. It's going to cost us an extra $544 on top. Let's see if it works. And we're ready to go. I've got everything. We've leased it all. Well, we've done the, the thingy that they did right there. Let's change our driving direction because now we need to do it like this. We're going to have a little bit extra room right there. There we go. Perfect. The, the turning is the only thing that's going to get me. To be honest with you, that's not going to be... Oh, this is going to be real awkward. Real awkward. As a matter of fact, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure that that's going to work. Let's, uh... Yeah, I'm real confused right now. Let's change the driving direction back to the way it's supposed to be. Let's grab this guy right here, which is our wind rower. So we've got that. And we need to get out of here. There we go. We've got that. Perfect. Now, I, uh, I want to try to get that contract done before we do our own I don't, i'm not sure which one we should do but i do know one thing having the time set at times 10 might be a little bit difficult to try and get everything done so for this i am going to bring this down to uh, bring the time down to at least times five we may even do times one as a matter of fact why don't we do that how about this? We'll do times two. So it'll still be speeding up, but we've got, well, you know, we've got stuff to do. So there we are. Let's, uh, matter of fact, let's just jump on their field first. Since, actually, we don't actually have to do that, do we? <gasps> no, we don't. Yo. Yeah, I'm so, I, I've never done, like, a cheating contract where I just cheat the game out of its own stuff before. So this is all brand new to DJ Ham right now. Let's head down to our first field. Let's just go to the biggest grass field that we've got. See if this actually works. All right, there's a chance this works. There's a chance this doesn't work. I'm sure it I mean, I can't imagine why it wouldn't. That's the thing. There's that. Let's go and get that unfolded. Drop it down. And get in a position where we can actually start moving, I guess. About right, uh, right there. That's about good. Take the weight. Weight's, weight's probably fine. I'll bring it down a little bit. Nah, let's not drag the ground with it. And turn the mower on. It is reserved for contract work. Imagine that. Boy, it don't work at all. Not a bit. Gotta be honest with you. A little upset. Slightly upset. But you know what? I'll... <laughs> I'll figure it out. How about that? But in the middle of this entire brush fire, that is going to be it for today. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like, or please subscribe. If you got any questions, drop them down in the comment section below. This series is taking it out of me. I gotta tell you that. I'll be honest with you, I love recording it. It is so much fun to record because the whole time I'm like, how do I do this? How can I do this? How can I make more money? I need to make more money. Crap. The whole time. <laughs> With all that being said, I hope you guys have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace. Peace.